Hello everyone, welcome to Infigyan once again in this very very exciting video of exponential equations. In this video, we will be solving one very interesting question. Question is x cube is equal to 20 plus 14 square root 2 power 1 over x. Left hand side we have got one cubic polynomial function and right hand side we have got one exponential function. As you all know, x negative, if x is negative, then our left hand side would be negative x cube power is odd so negative right hand side we have exponential function so that would be always positive okay now x positive case if x is positive then you can see lhs is positive as well as rhs is by default positive it is so which case we will accept that is x positive accepted this will be rejected we won't accept is because of left hand side is negative right hand side is positive no solution you will get so x negative will be rejected so conclusion is x must be positive only okay okay now let's see the lhs rhs graph a bit discussion about that if you will notice the graph of exponential function it is of the form a power 1 over x we are talking about a greater than 1. If you will check the value, it is all means greater than 1. If we will find out that value. a power 1 over x. Okay. If I will draw it, then I have to check limit value also. If x tending to 0, this a power 1 over x would be infinity. So I am trying to only sketch it, how it is possible. x 0, so it is coming out from infinity. Now let's check the end behavior at x tending to infinity also a power 1 over x so a power 0 that would be 1 value will tend towards 1 so at infinity okay so our graph would be the right hand side function graph would be like this okay now let's draw the graph of lhs this function x cube let me write this is a power 1 over x now x cube x cube is cubic polynomial so it is monotonic increasing function and behavior x tending to minus infinity function is minus infinity and x tending to plus infinity function is infinity so what is conclusion from here we will get solution but only one single solution is there okay Second point, x cannot be equal to 0. Because at x equal to 0, function would be, RHS would be undefined, something power infinity. So that would be undefined. So we will eliminate this point from the domain. So only we have to find out this solution. Okay. How we will solve this? Now question arises, either the methods available, let me write methods available. First method is, you can use newton ramson method you can put few values of x first frame the function fx few values of x check where sign is changing that interval we can frame it we can find out exactly second method is lambda w function other methods also available but i am showing you lambda w function method that is very very simple which i feel okay so let's simplify first let me show you 20 plus i am trying to simplify this one if you don't want to simplify you can go directly this value i am trying to write 20 as 12 plus 8 okay now 14 i am writing 12 plus 2 so i will write 12 root 2 plus 2 root 2 okay now this 8 i am thinking about it is 2 cube this 8 and this 2 root 2 let me put one arrow i am thinking about root 2 whole cube see the analogy 8 i am considering in my mind that it is 2 cube 2 root 2 i am thinking about root 2 whole cube so in my mind it is running that why don't we consider 1 is a 
consider in your mind this is my a a cube and this is my b b cube so let us frame for 3a square b plus 3ab square now it is recalling one standard identity a plus b whole cube let me write that formula first a cube plus b cube plus 3a square b plus 3ab square this is what we know now we have done a cube this is our a cube this is our b cube only we have to check only we have to check for 3a square b let's check 3a square okay a is, a is 2 so 2 is square b is root 2 3a square b is done plus 3ab square a is 2 b is square root 2 whole square only check if it is matching with 12 root 2 and 12. Okay. So it is 4 times 3. 12 root 2. And this is 6 times 2. 12. Yes. It is exactly matching. That means this whole base of this exponent or exponential form in the RHS. This whole base we can write. It is 2 plus square root 2 whole cube. See other methods are also available. Consider m plus n whole cube. Expand it. Compare both sides. And you can find out the way. But this is general method. If you can write in this manner. Clue is simple square root 2. This is the clue. Means one function is confirmed. A plus b I am talking. One variable. Not function. One variable is confirmed. That is root. Okay. Now let's solve this equation. What I will write x cube is equal to this equation. x cube will be equal to let me write 2 plus root 2 whole cube. And then power is 1 over x. Okay. Now what I will consider cube root both sides or you can use the exponent property a power b whole power c can be written as a power b c equal to a power c whole power b. So I am I am going to take the product in the exponent. So it will become x cube is equal to 2 plus square root 2 whole power is 3 over x. Now take cube root both sides. Once I will write cube root then it will become x is equal to 2 plus square root 2 whole power 1 over x. Simple it is. Now, now question is very very easy. We will solve quickly. 2 plus square root 2 whole power 1 over x. Let's take ln both sides. ln x is equal to 1 over x ln 2 plus square root 2. Done. Now take this denominator x to the left. So it will become x ln x equal to ln 2 plus root 2. Okay. Now using exponent property x can be written as e raised to the power ln x. So I will write e raised to the power ln x times ln x equal to ln 2 plus root 2. Now only basic property of lambda w function which states that x into e raised to the power x and we are taking lambda w both sides then this value would be x. Okay. x times e raised to the power x equal to x once you are dealing with lambda w application. So left hand side you will see only this is x. See this multiplier and the exponent power should be matching so it is matching let's take lambda w both sides so what i will write ln x equal to lambda w of ln 2 plus root 2 so x will be equal to e raised to the power lambda w ln 2 plus root 2
okay now if you will check using wolfram alpha then x will come out 1.905 so that value of graph, let me draw one more time. This is our right hand side exponential function. And if you will draw the draw the graph of x cube, this is this point. So this intersection is 1.905. I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for watching. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye-bye till next video.